back in like 2018 that's that's when me and Kalina like first got together back when it was like real good being together I believe Justin and Kalina have grown apart he has messed around on her he has told me multiple times that he's not in love with her anymore but he does love her so I just think with all cheating and stuff like that it's just time to probably go their separate ways because it's just killing my daughter in the beginning I was loyal faithful honest ish you know what I mean went to jail messed up okay I'm thinking she gonna hold it down so find out she talking to some dude stayed in the same apartment complex I get to hear from somebody that she pregnant with that dude kid and I'm like damn you know what I mean it was like kicking the face you know what I mean and I get a brand new truck and I'm in jail I find out later down the road baby girl had bro bro in my truck bumping my speakers listening to my subs on my rims he's the only homie that I know of that she was out here kicking it with hanging out with riding around in my truck with as far as me sleeping with Justin I never have and I never would as far as uh, sleeping with mom go boy I mean no nah, I didn't definitely didn't do that just because we hang out don't mean we we back there humping you know what I mean yes Justin would come over, we'd have a couple drinks, we would go out to the casino, I mean, we'd have fun together, but that's as far as it would ever go. We were supposed to go to Vegas, man, and gamble, because I ain't never been there. I like to gamble. She said she would take me. She didn't take me. When I was planning a trip to take my kids to Vegas in April of last year, he wanted me to take him instead of my girls, and he goes, whatever happens in Vegas, stays in Vegas. It just made me feel really uncomfortable, that comment. She told me before they even went on, a, went on a trip that we would go to Vegas because that's what we do together. We gamble. Ain't no sex in gambling. I mean, if she say anything different, her mama liar too. You know what I mean? And then on New Year's Eve, Justin showed up at my house. Colino was not with him. You know, we was drinking a little bit, whatever. So we said something about strippers. I was like, I put a pole up. And she was like, I'll dance on it. A comment was made between me, Justin, and a friend of mine about a stripper pole and me dancing on the stripper pole, which, well, that's inappropriate. You don't say that, you know? You don't say that to your mother-in-law. That's all it was, was some fun. About two years ago, my ex got in my drawer and he pulled out a tablet and it had this letter on it. And it was a secret letter and it stated in detail how this person wanted to sleep with me and how they wanted to sleep with me. And at the end, it said, we could keep this a secret. All right, there was this letter, right? And uh, I guess it was like some dirty little secret uh, sex letter. And we didn't know who wrote it. Well, my daughter came over. I showed it to my daughter. And when my daughter seen the letter, she knew exactly that it was Justin's handwriting. And she started crying. Yeah, I wrote that. You know what I mean? I did that, okay? But I, I got reasons for that, you know what I mean? He acted like it was no big deal and brushed it off. So I definitely need that lie detector test, man, because uh, I need to know what well, she was messing around with some of my friends. The reason why I came to the show is so I could prove to my daughter that I've never slept with her husband. I never would sleep with her husband. I love her with all my heart, and I just want me and my daughter to have that mother-daughter bond again. I miss my daughter. I want my daughter back. Colina, I love you with all my heart, and I would never, ever hurt you like that. I just want you to know that you're my little girl, and you'll always be my little girl, and I love you. Colina, what the hell is going on? <laughs> Well, see, um, like, I take full accountability for cheating on him, like, and I know it's not right. Did you cheat while he was in jail? Yes. After he got married? Yes. Like, I got pregnant and um, got an abortion so that he wouldn't find out about it. Pregnant by somebody else? Yeah, right after we got married. Uh, he found out about it, and I thought we got past all that. Like, he told me he was, he was going to forgive me for it, move on. How and, did he find out that you cheated? Because um, everybody else was telling him. What happens when he gets out of jail? They told me that they were, that we would forget about it and move on. Well, like a year passes and 
um, I hacked his Facebook and I found out he was cheating on me with my sister. With your sister? Mm -hmm. Were you and your sister close? Uh, yeah, I used to talk to her and hang out with her like every day. And I confronted him about it and he denied it but then admitted it. And um, so I went to her and I'm like, what's up, dude? Like, you're, I thought we were better than this. And she lied. And then I got her to finally admit to it. And she was like, she, that, she told me that she would stop talking to him and never did. And they kept sleeping with each other. And like, currently, like currently still. She's still sleeping yes, with her husband currently. today. And I feel like, I feel like um, I know I deserve better. Like I take full accountability for what I've done in the past. Like if I could change anything, you that would is, have never slept yes, with I would have never did none of that. He has a good mouth and stuff. He can talk. Like the way he makes me feel when he's around me, he can talk real good. Yeah. But he also is sleeping with your sister. I know. It's sick. I mean, right there would be, for most of them, would be like, end the story, that's done. And uh, he wrote your mom a, a very letter. sexually explicit letter. And he admitted to it. It's not like he's denying it. He wrote her a letter saying, I want to, you know, you. Mm -hmm. My mom has slept with my ex-boyfriend already, and that's why I feel like there is. Wait a second. Your mom slept with your ex-boyfriend. In 2014, I was locked up in Geneva. And how did you find out about that? Um, a, another family member told my mom that if she didn't tell me that... So your mom told you? Yep, my mom and what took was that me downstairs like? and was like, beating around the bush like, oh, sis, look, here, here, here's your room. You come home in 30 days. And I'm like, just get to the point, dude. And she's like, I slept with so-and-so. And I was like, what? Do you believe that your husband has slept with your mother? I do deeply think that my mom and my husband have slept <laughs> together. She did it to me once, why couldn't she do it to me again? Yeah, I never met your mom, and I'm guessing, yeah, she did. But like, at the end of the day, like, my mom, like. Okay, let me ask you something here, Kalina. You're, you're not a dumb person. I'm not dumb at all. I don't think you're dumb. Why would you stay with this guy? I mean, my listen. Kids. How you doing, Steve? Hey, Justin, how are you? I'm good. You, you got married in prison, right, over the phone? Yeah. Yeah. Why did you want to get married? I loved a girl who was uh, there for me. You know what I mean? We spent a lot of time together. I got to know her. She's a beautiful person. She's a good mom. She, she, I mean, she, she's amazing. Hold on. Yeah. You loved? Justin, you loved the way I used to be? I love. And I still love. Your sister's, a, your sister's a good friend. She's a really good friend. Like, Justin, you do things with my sister that you don't do with me, dog. I mean... I get, I, dude, I have never even been to the bar with you, dog. Never. But you go to the bar with my mom, my sister. Like, come on, dog. That's a lie. When we go That's to the bar. You, you went to the bar with me and my mom. You do admit that you've slept with uh, Kalina's sister. Yes. Yeah. Yes, I did. When was the last time you slept with her? <clears throat> Be honest. It was recent. How recent? Uh, it was real recent. Like real, well, how, tell me please. In, come on, how, how recent? A few days ago. Justin, that... did you sleep with her sister yesterday? I mean... Come on, come on, dog, it's me. <laughs> Why do you sleep with the sister? Let's focus. I'm tired of the fight, man. Like, all me and you do is fight. Fight, fight, fight. That's all we do. So you enjoy sleep. You. you enjoy sleeping with the sister. You love me, but you're not That's... in love with me, right? I don't want to stop talking to your sister because she's my friend. You know what I mean? She's. You can't she's stop sleeping friend. with her, though. You cannot stop sleeping with her. I'll stop sleeping with your sister. And that's like, I'm going to stop dyeing my hair. I mean. You will stop sleeping with the sister. Absolutely. Yeah.
I love you. Mom, if you love me, you wouldn't do this stuff. I want you to finally realize that I would never do this to you. Me and Justin has never done this to you. Because I know how it feels to be hurt from like this. Okay? And I would never hurt my own child the way I was hurt like then this. Then why did you hurt me before like that? That was a long time ago. <laughs> but it's still in my life. Though. That was a long time. And it, it was your ex. It was your ex. It wasn't your husband. It's different when it's your husband. You guys made a vow together. But you did sleep with one of your daughter's boyfriends. An ex-boyfriend. They weren't married. Yeah, I mean, but so... come on, Mom. I mean, it, who, what mom sleeps with her daughter's ex-boyfriend? <laughs> All right, now, Nika, you came here to took a lie detector I test. I did. Okay, I'm, Mom, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to lie. I hope you fail. Oh, <laughs> you hope I fail? Yeah, Why? I do. Because <laughs> I'm going to pass. Well, I'm going to fail because maybe this would be the thing that would push Kalina away from Justin. Maybe, maybe... Maybe this is gonna push her away from him anyways. Uh, so you came here, took a lie detector test, and we asked you, have you ever had sexual contact with Kalina's husband, Justin? You answered no. Have you ever had sexual intercourse with Kalina's husband, Justin? You answered no. The results came back the same to each question, and it came back that Nanika told the truth. Hi, Steve. I'm Kalina's sister. Kalina, first, I just want you to know that I would have never started sleeping with Justin or probably even hung around with him if you guys weren't separated. I don't ever drink, and you know that, and a little bit of alcohol was involved that night. One thing led to another, and it happened. I know that you think that last time him and I were together was in October, but in all reality, it was more recent than that like yesterday recent. I also need to tell you a couple nights ago and we got them on our necks under our ears and the meaning of them kind of defeats the purpose of us getting them if I tell you. So I'm just gonna tell you that it's our way of knowing we care for each other. We're always gonna be there for each other as friends because he is my best friend and I'm his regardless if you believe me or not. Our relationship or friendship is not about sex. It's really not. There's no way you're going to stop sleeping with her. Look, Justin, me and you are done. I want a divorce from you. We're done, dog. We are done. Listen, 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 baby. What do you mean? Me and you have been together for six years. I've been telling you so to walk stop to talking to her. I was in the prison. You Since hung up on me yesterday because I told you to stop talking to her. Listen. And then when I go back and tell her. Can I ask you something? Why didn't you take the lie detector test? Why didn't you come take one? Is her Listen. sister there with you now? Yes. No, absolutely not. Come on. Yeah. You, want, you want to see a bathroom? Yeah. Out in the hallway. Yeah. Out in the hallway, Justin. Yeah. Open, the, open, the, open the door. <laughs> Okay. okay, I'm done with the show. I'm done with the show. Okay. You want me to go outside? Just, Justin, has, has she been in that whole ro that hotel room at all? What? Yes, she has. She has. He's dirty, dog. Huh? He's dirty. Okay. Can I be done with the show? Let's, yeah. The, but yeah, Clint, you can, listen, you, listen, well, listen. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You want to be done with the show, right? I want to be done with the show. Yeah, but don't you want to be done with him? I just want to go home. I want to be done with the show. Okay. okay. Is there anything okay. you want to say to him before you leave? No. No. All right. All right, Justin, she says she's done, but I think uh, in all actuality, she'll be coming home right to you. Thank you, So, good luck to you. Thanks for coming yeah, on. Thanks. Can you relate to this story? Go to www.stewilkos.com to get my help.